Welcome to Electron Line, and now let's look at multiplying by 9. The multiplication table again should be memorized outright. 9 times 1 is 9, 9 times 2 is 18, 9 times 3 is 27, 9 times 4 is 36, 9 times 5 is 45, 9 times 6 is 54, 9 times 7 is 63, 9 times 8 is 72, 9 times 9 is 81, and 9 times 10 is 90. I remember that I always like to multiply by 9 because I remember as a kid I saw a certain pattern in there. Notice that I looked at 9 times 1 as 10 minus 1, and 9 times 2 as 20 minus 2, and 9 times 3 as 30 minus 3, and 9 times 4 as 40 minus 4, and 9 times 5 as 50 minus 5, and continuing, 9 times 6, I saw that as 60 minus 6, 9 times 7 was 70 minus 7, 9 times 8 was 80 minus 8, 9 times 9 was 90 minus 9, and 9 times 10 was simply 90. And then I even thought of a different way of doing it, because then I realized when I looked at 9 times 6, I would subtract 1 from the 6, and then add to that the difference between 10 and 6. So 6 subtract 1, I get 5, and 10 subtract 6, I get 4. And I would do the same with 9 times 7. I would put the number 1 less than this down, and then 10 minus 7 is 3, and it would be 63. 9 times 8, I grab a number 1 smaller than 8, which is 7, and take 10 minus 8, which is 2. 9 times 9, I would take 1 less than 9, which is 8, and 10 minus 9, which is 1. And so very quickly, I was able to come up with the answers to the multiplication tables of multiplying times 9 by simply either taking, adding a 0 and then taking 1 away, adding a 0, taking 2 away, adding 0, taking 3 away, adding 0, taking 4 away, adding 0, taking 5 away. And then when the numbers became bigger, then I simply subtracted 1 from that number and then added 10 minus that number, subtract 1 from the number, which is 6, add 10 minus 7, which is 3, subtract 1 from that number, which is 7, add 10 minus 8, which is 2, subtract 1 from this number, which is 8, and add 10 minus 9, which is 1. And there's one other thing you can look at. Notice that all the answers, if you add the two digits together, well, here you only have one digit, which is 9, but add 1 plus 8, you get 9, add 2 plus 7, you get 9, add 3 plus 6, you get 9, at 4 plus 5, you get 9. So always make sure that when we add the two numbers together, they add up to 9 or the number is wrong. 5 plus 4 is 9, 6 plus 3 is 9, 7 plus 2 is 9, and 8 plus 1 is 9. Of course, 9 plus 0 is 9 as well. That's another way to check and see if your answers are right when you multiply by 9. Those are neat little tricks you can play when you use the multiplication table with 9. And that's how we do that.